क्वेश्चन नंबर 126 डाइमॉर्फिक क्लोरोप्लास्ट आर सीन इन डाइमॉर्फिक क्लोरोप्लास्ट आर सीन इन द सी4 प्लांट्स एंड शुगर केन इज अ सी4 प्लांट सो द करेक्ट ऑप्शन फॉर द गिवन क्वेश्चन इज ऑप्शन नंबर 2 लेट्स मूव टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर 127 सेलेक्ट द ऑड वन विद रिस्पेक्ट टू द सेल ऑर्गेनल्स इन्वॉल्वड इन फोटोरेस्पिरेशन इन केस ऑफ फोटोरेस्पिरेशन देयर इज अ इन्वॉल्वमेंट ऑफ क्लोरोप्लास्ट पेरोक्सिजोम and mitochondria so the odd one is lysosome so the correct option for the given question is option number 4 let's move to the next question question number 128 which of the following is not a product of non cyclic photophosphorylation o2 nadph and atp they all are the products of non cyclic photophosphorylation but not the nadh so the correct option for the given question is option number 4 let's move to the next question question number 129 study the pathway given below here you are seeing the c4 pathway or you can say this is the mesophyll cell and this is the bundle sheet cell here you have to identify a b and c this is c over here so this is a this is b and this is c so a is a c4 acid which is transported in the bundle sheet cell so it can be malic acid aspartic acid so it is a c4 acid so option number 1 and 4 are ruled out now after the transportation there is decarboxylation of the c4 acid hence there is a release of co2 and it will lead to the formation of c3 acid so this is the decarboxylation so b is decarboxylation and after decarboxylation there is a formation of c3 acid so the correct option for the given question is option number 3 let's move to the next question Question number 130 all of the following are requirements for chemiosmosis except thylakoid membrane proton pump atp synthase they all are required for the chemiosmosis but more protons in the stroma than lumen no more proton should be in the lumen than the stroma for the chemiosmosis so the correct option for the given question is option number 4 let's move to the next question mm -hmm. 